So who wants to race? I'm okay. You're right. Okay. A shark, a wolf, a shark, it will feel like you're going to hurt the shark. If you did pretty good. Him or her. Pretty good. Hopefully she Vibrations from a spear fisherman. You didn't, you got to fix that. Okay. Sounds like you didn't let someone else do the summary of it. Alright, homies. You can't, you can't end something from the beginning. No, because this is at the end. I feel like the story. But there's actually more to that. Yeah, no. Do you really want to add more to it? A water, when Jada said, when if you. Oh, you're right. It does say shy, so that's exactly it. I did not look close. I <laughs> gotta edit that. Okay, look over that. Good job, Jada. Sharks. Let's change that. Can we like change this sentence? Not like the same exact thing, but like, could I like change it in a different way? Yeah, put it in your words. Well, yeah, a summary is just telling the story, but in your, in your words. So Jada, so Jada, when Jada, when you said um, if you make any fast movements, um, like if you make any fast movements, the shark will attack. Something like that. Yeah. Wait, Wow, you're a better girl than me. You should see my shirt. I like your shirt too. Thank you. We're not attack people for. The eyes. A purpose. What was the next one you said, Jada? I said yeah. after um, after she makes a sentence. If you corner a shark, it'll feel like you're gonna hurt the shark. Oh, uh, oh snap! I mean, hurt him or her? Cause yeah, cause there's girls yeah. and boys for sure. So let me erase this. Because I didn't need this. Um, I'm going to let you draw that. Why?
because yeah, so there's three. So we're gonna bring that in the shark. Don't surround it. Don't erase it if that was here. Okay, so that's stuff and it's like shark type. Does everyone have a little Yeah, we're going to take it from the paper. Oh, sorry. Alright, you guys need to do that. Hey, we are not writing on ourselves here. Come on. Okay. So let's make sure we all have it on our paper. So the cause, if a person moves quickly in the water, and then we need the effect. So that's the cause, but we need to make sure we have the right effect. Does anyone have the effect on their paper? All right, let's go check. Come on over here, let's look at your own papers. Jeremy, where's your paper? No one has it? Mine doesn't have it. Mm, no one has it. We might have to sit down. Okay, so the cause, what does it say? If a person moves quickly in the water, what's the effect? When you show a shark, you feel water. What about right here? What will happen? The shark will attack you in the water because it will kill you. Okay, so the effect is a shark will attack you, right? So let's put that one more time on. If a person moves quickly in the water, the shark will attack you in the water. Good, that's good. That's all we need. The shark will attack you. So go ahead and write that down right there. The shark will attack you. And remember, to, if you need a word to, um, to spell it correctly, it should be in the top paragraph. So everyone should have shark spelled and attack spelled correctly because it's shark attack. Shark. Real good. His handwriting looks a lot better. We've been working on it a little bit. Yeah. Okay, so let's go. So if a person moves That's because you already read it like a million times already, and I'm like, change it. No, because because I had to change it because it wasn't uh, good enough to write on the paper for the summer. Because once you put it on that paper, it sticks here. Unless we use a pencil. But always a pencil has eraser. That's why I said unless it's a pencil. Oh. He did but then I had to fix it. Cause there's more to one sentence than just I just hit my funny elbow. What is that word right there? What is that word right there? What word? Water. Oh, it's not. I forgot the R. He's a big head. Okay. <laughs> So here, what are you doing? We're finding out who 
who can draw a better shark so the illustration can be good. Yeah. Okay, so what should your illustration look like? We're looking of making like a shark, shark being scared of what a human's doing. Yeah. Being scared of like movements in the water from a human kicking. Like, we're thinking of making it be a shark being scared of a human in the, in the, in the water swimming, and so they're like backed up, kind of scared. Okay. And they both want to be um, the illustrator. And, the both want, and they both want to be yes. the illustrator, so they're doing the contest to see who's keeping the better shark. Yes. So what are we working on over here now? We're uh, working on the summary. Yeah, so we're almost finished with the summary. Okay. So I'm going to do the cards and Zainab's going to do the effect. No, I'm going to do the effect. And then Zainab's going to do the effect. I can't hear you. So, um, I'm going to do the class. My, um, Maya's going to do the effect, and Zainab is going to do the illustration. So, if it doesn't feel right, or if it's hungry, you want to So, both of those are acceptable answers. Okay, so, I never asked people for the soul. Good. Sharks never attack people for the sole purpose of hunger. That is an awesome sentence. That's the one we might have to use. So if you don't have anything in the last one, you can say shark. Oh, huh. Say it again. Shark. Sharks never attack people for sole purpose of hunger. Good. And the effect is they won't attack you if they're hungry. So cause they won't attack if they're hungry. And the effect is or the cause is if they're hungry, the effect is they won't attack. If you need help, Jeremy, a great person to ask is Elma. Yes.